Hi, I'm Dr. Doron Scher from Low Carb Doctors. You can find more information about us at lowcarbdoctors.com.au. What I'm going to do today is go through with you how to do blood ketone testing using the Freestyle Optium Neo. What you'll need is the actual Optium Neo. You'll find within the, the box this black bag, and within the bag you'll find the actual ketone testing meter over here, and you'll find the finger prick tester which you will need to put the lancets in. You'll also need to purchase the ketone strips themselves as a separate, separate item. So let's go ahead now and test our ketones. The first thing we're going to do is get a, a ketone testing strip. And we're going to open the packet with the ketone testing strip. This has two ends, one which has black and white strips on it, the other has a white stripe on it. We're going to put the black and white stripes up into the ketone testing meter and that will then start to flash and it'll have a little blood droplet meter there and it'll say KET indicating that it's testing ketones rather than blood sugar level. You're going to then need one of the thin lancets. Now the lancet comes like this with the little round knob protecting the uh, actual sharp part. So in order to open up the actual trigger mechanism, you push forward on this grey lever, which pops the top off. You put the lancet inside and then twist the protective cap off. Now keep this protective cap for later. You put the cover on and then you set the numbers according to how thick your skin is. For me, it's usually about one and a half and you adjust it by twisting this top black knob. You arm the device by pulling down, you'll hear a click. You then push it against your finger. And if you press more firmly, generally it hurts less. You, to deploy the actual lancet, you push this gray button here. So push firmly, deploy the, the, the lancet, and it will make you bleed. Now, if this happens where the, the needle hasn't penetrated deep enough, you can either try it again or set it to a deeper setting. You'll get a well um, a small well of blood come up. You touch that blood against the white strip of the meter until such time as you see the three lines come up over here. There'll then be a countdown that tells you 10, 9, 8, 7, 6 to get to 1. After that you need to dispose of your sharp. So again, pop this off, put the round part of the blue to cover the needle and then you can take that out and safely dispose of the lancet without it affecting anybody else. You can then look at your reading. Now for me my reading is 1.6 today but really there isn't a better or worse reading. If you're looking for weight loss you need to be above 0.3 but there are certain medical conditions where you might want to have readings of 4 or 6 but you need to tailor it according to what you, you need to do. So. In a nutshell, that's how we test ketone uh, levels in our blood um, and uh, more information can be found at lowcarbdoctors.com.au.